pretty, pretty flower. There's always one thing I forget to do. Hello Mitch, hello Lacey, welcome back. Hello Deltra, hello Mountain, X-File, Retro, Willow, um, Jose, hello, hello. I hope we're all doing well and hello Dobby, I shall get your random fact. Random fact, you were way too early to click that redeem. You're floofy. <laughs> Thanks for noticing X-File. Okay, random fact time. <clears throat> so, I've gotten everything set up. Well, at least I thought I did. Okay. Wow, that was a shit one. So is that one. Ugh. Okay. Pen serophobia is the intense and disproportionate fear of your mother-in-law. 
That's why I never remember. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I got the tags. I, I think I did it. Because I already changed them. Yeah. Master has presented Dobby with clothes. Dobby is free. Trying to click the first redeem. But it wouldn't load, so he had to refresh. Then <laughs> Mitch got it. He was like waiting for the second. Gonna hop into Mitch's, but the stream refused to work for you. Oh no! Well, I think he'll be streaming tomorrow. Correct me if I'm wrong, Mitch, but um, I think he might be streaming tomorrow. This is an Udi. I'm very cold today. I have two pairs of socks on. Just common sense. <laughs> I don't mind my mother-in-law. I've lived with her for three months. So I kind of have to like her, you know? Although I guess people live with their mother-in-laws and don't like them. I don't know. But, um, okay. So I was like, yep, I got everything ready, like on time. I did my Instagram and my Twitter story. And I was sitting here. And I was like, you know what? I'm, I'm good. I'm set. Like, I'm just, you know, I'm ready to go. I had my cameras all done. Like I did my cameras. I did the mix it up like I you know you would have noticed that the mix it up bot decided that it was going to show you the images today because I made sure to refresh it even got my fairy lights on I felt so organized I didn't even set up like the reference photos on my canvas that's the one thing I forgot the important thing you know the thing that I have to actually use to make the art yeah mm -hmm. actually quite warm here I'm wearing a jumper and I'm wearing the Udi over the top Then you got a Discord message. Mitch got it first. That's great. Whose references? We're going in blind. A soon-to-be monster-in-law? No! Oh, gosh. I feel so sorry for people that have terrible mother-in-laws or, like, overbearing mother-in-laws. Mine, um, looked after me and fed me drugs when I was sick, so... And gave me a platypus that smelled like lavenders. <laughs> and that was that wasn't a drug-induced thing, that was an actual thing. Hey Grab, how are you? How was your birthday? Bit cold, yeah. Mm -hmm, it's raining and cold. <laughs> Did you like that one, Mitch? Heavily disliked you. His family didn't think we would laugh, but here we are eight years in November. Whoa. That would suck. You spent the day with friends. Nice, nice. Did you finish off the cake? Mine's lovely. She can just be a bit overbearing. Yeah. Well, mine was great. She's kind of left us to our own devices unless we need something and unless I was sick and then I got drugged. <laughs> it's still warm there. I'm so cold. I'm trying my best not to use like the heater. I did put the heater on um, for a little bit yesterday when I came home because it was just, the house was so cold. Like when there's no one in it except for the cats, the house is just so freezing. So I came home from my mom's yesterday and I put the heater on for a little time. Both weekend days, that's probably why. Wait, you see her both? I didn't even see my own mom both weekend days. Kansas doesn't have winter. It has dry season. Really? Ours is really wet. Like, our winters are usually quite rainy. You guys, winter is the opposite of the US. Um, yes. Well, technically, that means it would be autumn here. But yes. It's very, very cold autumn so far. Um, I was up at Dad's on Saturday. Yeah. I was up at my Dad's on Saturday, and, and it's always a couple of degrees cooler up there. My windshield had ice over it in Adelaide. Australia in autumn. That shit doesn't even happen in winter. Like, sure, you get it frosted over a little bit, but these there was literal chunks of ice on my windshield, and I was like, what the hell is this? I feel like I'm in Minnesota again. It's monsoon season up north. She comes to swimming on Saturdays and then comes over Sunday afternoons too. Whoa. I mean, I guess so if you didn't have children i don't think she would visit as often like i feel like that's something that would be like a grandparent instinct did she visit that often when you didn't have kids she definitely wouldn't yeah we're in the tropics summer is the rain season it's been quite wet, wet regardless regular rain it's gonna stop and then it won't rain until december 
Enjoy watching me clear the windows of ice, didn't you? Yeah. This time my dad had to do it for me. We saw her maybe every couple of months. Seriously, every couple of months? In the lovely season of it may snow, it may rain, or it may be 93, all within the same week. Yes, I've been hearing that. Happened about two weeks ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I've been hearing a, a bit about that. Ours is not that extreme, but it wasn't that cold a couple of days ago. I mean, I, I am thankful that I can wear like my jumper and my I, li I love wearing my hoodie. It's so big and cozy and warm and squishy. I love wearing it and I love having my hot water bottle. So I do enjoy that. But like sometimes it's just got that chill in the air and it makes you not want to do anything like it's because, OK, in America, you guys have like insulated houses um, and we do to an extent here too, but not to the same extent. Like when I was in America, I was in Minnesota, I was there over winter, so it was quite cold. The coldest that it got to was negative 30 or something Celsius. I keep saying the Fahrenheit one. I think I think I got mixed up, but apparently it was 30 Celsius and um, negative 30 Celsius. Sorry. And like I was outside in that. And yes, it was very, very cold outside. And I do feel for people that do have to go to work and stuff. But like when you're inside, it's warm. Like you don't really know what the temperature is outside. Like you don't wake up and think, oh, it's going to be a cold one today. Like you do in Australia. Like in Australia, you wake up and you can feel like your throat because it's been so cold overnight. And you're just like, oh, God, this is going to be cold out there. Like you're going to get out of your bed and you're going to freeze. Minus 22 Fahrenheit. Uh, bye. Didn't even see my own grandparents this often. That's crazy. I mean, I did. I saw them every day. It really does look comfy, though. It's a whole blanket. Do you guys not have these? I think they're an Australian brand. Australian houses are built to poor standards. They're built to keep the heat out. Like, so they're built so there's, um, like, an even flow of heat that can go in and out of the houses. They're not built to keep the heat in, whereas houses in America are built to keep heat in. Yeah, cold air. <laughs> They're built to um, keep the cold in and feel like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Hello, Snowy. How are you? What are we doing today? Um, a blank sheet of paper. I have to actually set up my references. I also have a cat behind me somewhere. She came in. I don't know where she went. But yeah, this thing is like, this thing is an entire like, oh, here she is. This thing is an entire blanket. I'll show you. Hang on. You know, I can't say hello to everybody. Look, there's Merlin. But this is like, it's an entire blanket. <laughs> blanket mom. Hey, come here. Come here. You want to sit on my lap? An Udi. Nephew really wants the cat paintings, by the way. He constantly talks about them and wants them in his room. Oh, that's so sweet. I love that. Um, if I keep the cold air in, they keep the warm air in. Heat house cools back down faster, and that's due to our poor building standards. I mean, yeah, in a way. Wait. <laughs> Hi, Mum. <laughs> Cold air in very well during the summer. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, that's that's what they're built for. But having spent time in America through winter, you guys don't know how good you got it. Although, like, the snow, having to, like, shovel snow would be annoying as hell. That would be the thing. That would be the worst part of it. Most of the time, I don't even know it's hot outside unless I go outside. I think your house is an older house, Dobby, and yours um, yours would be built with brick, whereas my house, you can absolutely tell that it's going to be a hot one outside. We, can, we can't do better until we accept the problem exists. It depends. I reckon they were built very well back in the day. Like, my mum's house is double bricked, and it keeps the cool in very, very easily. But it gets very cold. 
very easily too. Whereas my house is like a cardboard box. <laughs> it's like they wanted as many rentals to be built at the same time as possible. Like the bricks that the Saudis or Egyptians had to make them structurally sound without breaking down. That would be great. Like Australia would have like, like if we built houses like they, they built in like really hot deserty countries, like I think we'd have a better time. <laughs> Okay, let me set up this thing because I'm, oh, I'm very disorganized today. Well, I'm not actually. I thought I was doing really well. Eighth, the force. Good job. Not fun to say Australia doesn't build houses. Yeah. House is quite old. Yeah, I definitely think the older houses have it better. Um, well, depending on how they're built, like if they're built with brick, then yes. If they're like weatherboard houses, then no. Hey, Kay, how are you? Outback lacks the materials to do it. Good building limestone is hard to find these days. That's a good point as well. Like we don't have like the resources to, well, we don't really have the ease of getting those resources. Don't mind me. I'm just organizing my canvas here. Oh shit. Oh well, that's fine. A lot more timber houses. Best I can do. <laughs> Gotta scrub the Sahara clean and compress it to make new bricks. Okay, I'm good. Just gonna figure out how I wanna do this. Oh my gosh, hey Vivi. They need weatherboard houses in Queensland, otherwise they get too hot. Does New Zealand have any termite issues? Hey Loki! First time I'm going to watch how you start a drawing from the beginning. I just go, ta-da! <laughs> I just gotta figure out how I wanna do it. Like I have ideas. Um And I kind of know what I want to do, but I don't, I don't want to make it too, mm, yeah, magic. Make wood houses easier. Dobby is from um, New Zealand, by the way. Hey, Tiger Bee, good to see you. It's been ages, been so busy. Oh, quick sketch, what would you like? A cardboard box boat. All right. Um, well, the cardboard box boats are generally like, they're like taped on. I don't know. So we'll put like, we'll put like little, um, sticky tape here. It's going to be like a cardboard box rocket ship almost. <laughs> Shipped off to sea? What have I missed? Grew up on the South Island. Mm-hmm. Is that Olivia Newton-John? What? Mountain? Maybe. Mitch got it immediately and I was so impressed because Mitch is not like... There is a clue on my Instagram stories um, as to what Pokemon I'm drawing tonight. But yeah, Mitch got it immediately and I was so impressed because Mitch doesn't know Pokemon at all. <laughs> um, how do I want to draw this? Kind of want to do like...
What are my other target bees? I need to find them. There's so many. Guys, these are all like the sketches that I've done. Hey, Jube. Oh my gosh, I need to like organize them all. There's there's so many. These are all of like those quick sketches that we've done. I'm really bad at uploading them. Dear Lord. Why can't I find the one that I want? <laughs> So many drawings. <laughs> Maybe I need to put the channel point redeem up. Oh, there's one. Okay, okay, they're all there. Seventy k critic sketch. <laughs> no, I'm hiding. Okay, okay. These are all my tiger bees. All right, so I have more of a round head going on. Everyone lost their minds. <laughs> Try to get your first message for jumping randomly. I'm sorry, I missed you. I really say hi first. I like small talk. <laughs> Yeah, everyone does kind of lose their minds if, like, something like that changes. But I'm considering it at this point. I've, I've done a lot of them. You, you've done your um, TTPRG RPG rules writing now? Cool. I saw a story I was waiting to guess and you got scratch your quest. Take a minute for you to start drawing. I don't know how long I can stay today. That's okay. Most pleasant greetings, fine people of this fantastic screen stream. Speak talk. All right, so um, the story here is that Tiger Bee has made themselves a little box boat and they're sailing in it, but they're having trouble because um, there's no like sail. And that's effort. Insert hello bitches on it. <laughs> that's how I like to come into Dobby stream. My eye, oh my god, like my eye is killing me. I can't even. Like I've got, I don't know, like I've got like a sore. Like right on the, on the little, like inside and I just, ugh. I don't know how it started. But it's just dying. And then like the inside of my mouth feels like I've burnt the entire inside of my mouth and that hurts as well. So I can't like crunch on things. This is cute. Thank you. Something like that, Dobby. The stream ain't big enough for the both of us. <laughs> I'm cute. A few more weeks of classes left. Oh my gosh. And then what? Oh, then you have a baby, I guess.
I was waiting for it. I'm on holiday. The baby comes after semester two begins. Oh god. I, f I didn't realize there was a semester two. Any time for a kiss. That's what broke some of my siblings old one which is old and slow. It's already made the stream lag and drop quality a few times. Oh no. Australians love to eat Tim Tams. Do you enjoy this delicacy too? Absolutely. I love Tim Tams. Except I can't eat them right now because it just feels like, I don't know, like it feels like I've burnt the inside of my mouth and I just, I'm, I'm not having a good time. I like to punch myself. <laughs> Loki! Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, a four month streak. Well done. Here comes a sub. Da -da -da -da. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're so sweet. That is so lovely of you. Illegal to kill snakes. I don't think it's illegal to kill snakes. It's just not recommended. It's recommended that you get like a professional snake catcher just in case the, the snake is venomous and can kill you. Finished my semester with a 4.0 and finally free for the semester. I have to go back in, I think, August or September. I don't want to. Uh, yogurt had class today. What did yogurt do in class today? Also, I don't know what a 4.0 means. Our system is completely different. So if that's good, well done. I'm proud of you. Um, and I hope it's not bad because I don't know what to say in that case. <laughs> I discovered today that it stopped being cloudy. Wait, at night after weeks. Are you good, Jupe? You got another mission. Com mission. You've got another mission, Grab. Well done, I'm proud of you. <laughs> That's usually how it rolls too. Like you'll get a commission um, from someone who's had a commission and then it'll keep going like that. That was my first, that was how I kind of made my first sales is through word of mouth. I have some in my kitchen, but haven't tried them. The Tim Tams. Money I get for studying is too good. So I'm punishing myself by taking a full course load next semester. Holy shit. I choose to accept my mission. 4am sun is really, really bright. Hey, Scarlett, how are you? Only my first class, it was mostly, mostly lecture. To, uh, it was only first class, it was only lecture, but he was very excited. That's so cute. Hey, thanks, X-File. Um, can we please pin the um, Kofi link to the chat, please? A series of commissions, but we're starting with one. He's used as the example a lot. Aww. Fanfic author wants to get arch, art, arch, art of each of their characters. Look, I'm just, I'm just going to keep, I'm just going to keep drawing because apparently my terrible spelling has, um, translated now into terrible English. Mitch can attest to the fact that I've had a tough time with spelling things today. Um, you know, it just, my phone has not been on my side. I'm just going to, I'm just going to keep drawing. <laughs> I had blackout curtains, but they're not thick enough. Apparently, I did have one to swap in. That seems to work better. Get to visit me in a padded room with grippy socks. Nice. I'll come join you. A caval cavalier puppy? Aww. Name is Chloe. I like the name Chloe. TTS has been infected by her typos. Mm -hmm. Still need art done. Nice. Nice. I can do the arts. It's the highest, as Exile said. It was very stressful, but it was a lot of fun. Ah, nice. Sorry, I missed that, Exile. The New Zealand government is the one giving me a student allowance. The Australian government gives me tax benefit only. So, yes. Wow. That's so crazy.
All right, I'm almost finished. Oh, that's so crazy. <laughs> The double the amount weekly for my student allowance and what I get fortnightly for a baby. Whoa. Three regular size curtains to cover the wall. That's 90% glass. That is that is a lot of window. Sun shines directly into it. Hey, it's your boy. SS boat. Had to bring back the SS boat. Oh my God, my eye is killing me. You're going to hear me complain about this the entire stream. I'm sorry. Deal with it. Kept trying to run up, run up. Aww. You love it? I'm glad. Double dipping. Not a citizen. You will be soon, right? have to pay up front a dangerous animal in your um home like the brown snake no i've never seen a brown snake anywhere near where i live the only time i've seen a brown snake is in like a wildlife park i've also seen a tiger snake which Contrary to its name, it doesn't actually look anything like a tiger, nor does it have stripes. It's just black. And they're very venomous as well, but um, you just don't go up to it. Almost ran over one. Galactic pretzel. Yeah, I had to get into my pretzel. Want to color it? Yes, I will take a photo as usual and pop it in the Discord and I can send it to you on Insta uh, on Facebook if you remind me because I've been really bad at like remembering them. Are there more tiger bees or skunks? I don't know because I can't remember how many I did when I was in America. Yeah, where do you hear this? Probably from Australians, not gonna lie. We're a very sarcastic bunch and we like to scare people. So yeah, mm -hmm. you can absolutely find like sharks and snakes and crocodiles in every lake that you go near. <laughs> or Queenslanders. Yeah, honestly, most of the places in Australia that like tourists will go to, you're not gonna find stuff like that. You're not going to find spiders. You're not going to find, um, like, I don't wake up every morning and have to, like, sweep spiders out of my room. Tiger bees are skunks. I can't remember. I think it's almost even. A YouTube video about Queensland. My tigers at Dreamworld. Go to the tourist places, not Queensland. Queensland is not the wider Australia. <laughs> No, it's not. Most people that come to Australia, Australia, they're gonna go to um, Melbourne or Sydney, and they're gonna go to a city. Um, Queensland will only be like usually. It is. It is very much like. Well, for me, it was actually very similar to, like, California. So when I was in San Diego, San Diego looks very similar to Queensland, and the climate's very similar too. Very humid. But like most people that come to Australia, if they go to Queensland, they're gonna go to the Gold Coast or they're gonna go to Brisbane. So I've been to both of those and I didn't see any snakes and spiders there either. <laughs> they don't wanna go to Bali. Mm -hmm. Very hot and humid, like the south of USA. Yes, very hot and humid. And the further north you go, the more hot and humid it is and it's awful. I hated it.
random spots in random states. Yeah, I've been to Queensland several times actually. Heat and humidity of the far north Queensland is great. No. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, I don't know how I want to do this yet. Oh, I'm scared. This one is a commission. So I feel like there's a little bit more pressure. There's not... I, th look, I know there's not pressure. <gasps> oh my gosh. Thank you so much, Lagesh. Oh my goodness, thank you. That's so generous. Um, they stay away from cities and large amounts of people. So Bundaberg, Queensland, you will find snakes. Yeah. And that's the same with any state. If you go like further out to the country, yeah, you're going to find wildlife. It's meant to be seven degrees. When I was at my dad's, it was one degree. It was one degree after I left, but it was three degrees when I was leaving. And one degree, he said, was the lowest it got to. This is an autumn. Okay, I'm going to draw something now. I know that I've been procrastinating a lot. No pressure at all. Okay. Because what I want to do, I hope that it works. I don't know if I'm going to like it or not. So just bear with me. Strange cold spell. I really appreciate um, all the love and support on my Kofi lately. Um, also, I'm going to change my... Uh, I know this is going to be strange, but I'm going to change my ca canvas behind me to have the members of my Kofi. So I will still do like the Galaxy Calligraphy. It's just that they're going to stra like, straight away go on to the Hall of Fame. A wall of fame. It's just they're all stuck on a wall. And the ones that are um, a member on Kofi will have their name up on the canvas. So um, oh, I think I'll have like the two. I'll have both like the teapot level and the teacup level. So the teapots will go up the top and teacups will be down the bottom. But yeah, I'm going to do one for everyone that signed up to Kofi. So there's six members in the teapot level. And I think there's three in the teacup. But I wanted to have like a way to, I guess, showcase those people on my stream without having something in my overlay that comes across at a random time. Um, so I thought like doing it on that would be cool. Oh shit, I did too, mum. I'm so sorry. I forgot to brig. It's brigadoon. Enjoy your gravy, mum. A huge spider in your room. Oh my God, kill it. Congrats on the friendly roommate. No. A people? What's a people? It's a different Pokemon. Run out of my room. I can't do this. It's so scary. Don't worry. I completely understand. I hate spiders.
a multi multiple person, it's not going to go. No. I don't know how this head's going to work out. I think I might do the nose a bit lower. Where's the goat going? It's just going. Goat's a wanderer. Three in the morning, just sitting in the hallway in the dark because I'm so scared. <clears throat> Do you have any fly spray? Hydrate, everybody. Hey, Tari. Oh, nice. Well done. You've stumped me. Never take your eye off the spider. See you later, Jube. Good luck with the meeting. soon loki thank you so much for the support today you are absolutely amazing i hope you have a fantastic day i lost a mill millipede it literally just vanished how did you do that? Time to move? Millipedes are small. It's not like it's a centipede. Just vanished. How big do you guys think millipedes are? It's like there was a spider. There was like someone, someone said spider and everyone's like, oh yeah, okay, a spider. And then Dobby said millipede and you were just like, oh my God, a millipede. They're tiny. <laughs> 10 times bigger than centipedes, clearly. <laughs> millipedes are so small, like so much smaller than spiders. Like even like small spiders, millipedes are smaller. Mm hmm Yeah, they're so small. Spider's huge. They're like little tiny things. I could literally go get one for you because there's one on my wall. Millipedes are cute. Funny because of the names. Yeah, millipede implies that there's more legs. The giant wetter? No. How do they afford so many shoes? They just go barefoot like a hobbit. Um, no, I'm drinking green tea with honey. Don't you freaking dare. A New Zealand bug thingy. I assumed as much. Well, okay, millipedes might be larger where you're from, but like millipedes here are literally like this big. Like when they're stretched out. Bigger than a tarantula, ew. I'm all scared and fidgety. Aww. Unless you go bush. Yeah, it's kind of like spiders. I'm not loving how this is looking. I might do a different pose. I wasn't sure on the pose and how I'd be able to achieve it. I don't know. Like, 
Like, I think it'd look cool in this pose, but it's difficult. The centipedes that scare me here. Yeah, I would be, I would be scared of them too. I've only ever seen like one or two in my life. Hmm. Two total in my seven years. What are you drawing at the moment? <laughs> a Pokemon. Yeah, centipedes are heaps scarier than millipedes because you can see all their legs. Millipedes are just like the hard shelled bug things. Like, I know what I want to do. I just don't know if I can do it. <laughs> Living under my pavers. I still want to try. This thing's ears are not like normal cat's ears. I don't know if I'd have the strength to do it. You and tradies back away from one and comment on a size that's pretty big. Thank you for the stretch reminder. Don't forget to stretch everybody. You'll figure it out. Thanks. spider because I couldn't sleep so I thought if I can't sleep I should do something productive but I couldn't find my pencil so I went to see if I dropped it and the spider was right there oh no <gasps> at least you like found it though that's why you never do anything productive I don't like its head Rather stay ignorant. Yeah, I think so too, because there was a spider like underneath one of my cat's like sleeping areas. And it was not a fun time. It was right right next to my bed, and Mitch was I had to call Mitch. And I was like freaking out. Hey Blocker, how are you? I bug bomb my house regularly. I welcome my arachnid housemates right until they go a meter of my bed, then they die. That's exactly right. This one was like right next to my bed. Ignore them unless they're in a spot where my sibling can find them, then I take them outside. Well, that's what I do with millipedes. I just leave them. They're fine, unless the cats get them, which they don't usually. Good, thank you, Blocker. I'm glad that you're doing well. Lavender Cat is really pretty. Thank you. Let's actually show you something that I can draw because I'm having a tough time. I leave millipedes too. Yeah, there's like one on my wall. If they're on your bed, you flick them off like a spider. Okay, but if you were in Australia and there was a spider on your bed, I guarantee you would not just flick it off. Also because like, yes, whilst our spiders are not going to kill you as a, you know, adult human, um, if they are like an Australian spider, there's a good chance that your pet will get bitten. So I kill spiders for my pets as well, like as well as my own peace of mind. Why would you leave them? Why would you leave spiders? That's also gross. Also, if it doesn't kill you, it'll hurt a lot. Yeah. Mm hmm. Luna likes to play with them. So we got, 
I did this stupid camera. Actually, I think this one might be for my face cam. I did this stupid camera and it just doesn't like me. Are we even gonna get anything done today? Maybe. Oh, that's a bit better. Spiders are cute, they don't hurt you usually. Millipedes don't hurt you either. Millipedes are less likely to hurt you in Australia than spiders are. And they're less likely to hurt your pets than spiders are. I would rather my pet be alive than have a spider alive in my house. <laughs> the Skyrim art was a good baseline for it. All creatures in Australia are built different, remember that. I like that they're all like the same color theme for the first week. Blue. So creepy. Yeah, I hate them too. Yes, botanic cats. I like the lavender, it's one of my favorites. Hey, spiders too. Yeah, I think this one's one of my favorites. I don't know why. I just like the way that it's looking up at its own tail. Use the flower as a tail, yeah. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow's one, I haven't done tomorrow's one yet because I'm lazy. Preferably with a lighter. <laughs> hey, Transformer. But yeah, so tomorrow's is a lilac. Yeah, we're starting the purple week. So we did all blue. Now we're going on to purple. I don't go anywhere near spiders. Yeah, mm -hmm. I don't either. I'm very afraid of them. Especially when they're this large and they're right next to your bed. Change your snakes to foxes. Ooh, I look forward to seeing. Have you posted it? Yes, I know I set my house on fire, but there was a spider, I swear. I was like, okay, understandable. As you can see, I have absolutely nothing on my page yet. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out how I want to do the pose, but I'm, I'm all good. We're just going to experiment today. Oh, it's in Mayflowers. I was looking in the artist alley because I'm dumb. <gasps> oh, it's so cute. I love the little fox. Oh, the little lavender fox. Procrastination. Mm -hmm. Wonderful exploration of unmarked paper. Mm -hmm. Pretty much. <laughs> the Jersey Devil back when I was in fourth and fifth grade. Yeah, so this is a commission. Um, well, you know, procrastinate. I do have stickers. Do you want to see them? So I can procrastinate some more. Hello, uh, Salad. How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. Except I haven't done anything on my page, it's fine. Spiders in here, I'm going running out of the house. How many taste buds have changed with this baby? How come? What, what are you craving? We love to procrastinate here. These are the ones I got from America, so they're vinyl. Do carrots taste like bananas? Taste off to you. I made a chicken and bacon stuffed chicken breast and it just tastes wrong. Wow, that's so strange. I also have this one. This one's funny. Every cat owner knows. Cryptids are a big deal that you're scared of. I honestly never was scared of anything like that. Like up in the air too. Mm -hmm. I 
And I've got Merlin and Marty and Sunflower in here. Those are all my final ones. God, my eye is killing me and I don't have anything on my page. And I'm just like, oh. <laughs> Gonna be beginner problems in my life. Way bigger problems in my life. Being it to Aubrey instead. For our words on stream marathon, here we come. <laughs> Have those stickers too. And quicksand. Well, it was a problem for me because I lost my hat in Mario 64 in quicksand. I have a whip of mine in the Discord. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Hey, where did my picture go? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Dallin, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome officially to the Galactiverse. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my God. A pet portrait, it's adorable, little Jack Russell. 9%, someone help me, I charge in the room. Oh no, oh no. It's okay, it's okay. Can you like slap it with something? Do you have a shoe? Honestly, at this point I'd wake somebody up. A gift art, that's so cute. I love it. Good song. Wait till morning. I can't deal with spiders. Where are you going to go? Out of the fly, I don't think he knew I was here. Oh my god. <laughs> Sleep on the couch, just not stepping in my room until Spider is dead. I'm pretty sure. Um, oh no, I think I got the fly spray. There was a time when I was at my dad's house when I was younger, and um, there was definitely a spider that needed eliminating. It was huge, right? So I, it was in my room and I think I actually had fly spray in my room. It was like Mortein, right? It was, it was Mortein like double shot or something. So I like sprayed the hell out of this spider and I don't know where it ended up, but I walked out of my room the next day and it was like dead on the floor, like literally right out the front of my room. So it had crawled underneath the door frame to try and escape Watch one TikTok about coronation. I had so many TikToks about this. <laughs> but 
That's how TikTok uh, gets you. They're just like, oh, it looks like you like this topic. Let's show you more of it. even like him it's just the algorithm you hate thunder oh no you're not having a good night it's okay just stay here we're here for you You love thunder? I am okay with it. Like, I would prefer to have somebody to, like, cuddle. I just use melon. I saw Galactic Ground on the weekend, guys. She doesn't have any dirty jokes for us, but, um... I told her that you all loved her one about the donuts. Thought that is the horns. Do we reveal which Pokemon this is yet? Um, Mountain has guessed. But I mean, for those of you who still don't know and want to guess, then feel free. Donuts. I was thinking how much like pyro it looked like. But it is Luxray. I have questions about the donuts. She got told this apparently by someone in like the home that she's in. Like one of the other residents there. You lean into that a bit if you want a bit Luxray is great. Yeah, it's a Luxray. I don't think I've ever done Pyro. Were they handing out donuts when they told the joke? I don't know.
Jinx is a cutie. I saw Luxor is electric dark. Me too. Viewer plus one now. Did you make her an account? I should. <laughs> I thought that's what you meant, sorry. I think that back leg's a little too long. Just a touch. That's a little better. I'm gonna try and sleep before my phone dies. Oh, I hope that you get some sleep. I'm sorry about the spider. Like, I mean, bug are both common things people think. Yeah, and like, you know, Charizard being a dragon. I was talking to Mitch before about how time seems to have gone like really quickly. Like it doesn't feel like it's been so long since I was there. I, I don't know if it's due to the weather because like it's cold and it, it's just kind of been cold for an entire year for me, except for that one part where it was like really warm. Summon to feast. Enjoy your feast, Vivi. Enjoy the food as well. Yes, you should. Yeah, I feel like time has gone really fast, but at the same time... I kind of look at the fact that my cousin's birthday is coming up and I remember last year's birthday of theirs. Um, there was like two of them that are having birthdays at the same time. And it was postponed because um, one of them got COVID. So it was postponed for like a couple of weeks later. But at that time, there was only like a couple of days until Mitch was coming back to Australia the second time. So the fact that I've been invited to that birthday again it's kind of blowing my mind. It's wibbly wobbly. It is. Like, how is that? Like, how, how is that? It's kind of scary in a way. 
Because it's like, why? Why is time going so quickly? I like how um, almost like Egyptian Luxray looks. You broke Twitch? Oh no! Okay, I'm not a fan of that paw, but I'll get back to it. I thought the same thing with the stripes on the leg. Mm -hmm. Really striking silhouette. Yes, it does. Like, it's almost a mix between, like, uh... Like, Bastet and, um... Anubis. But... Retro, the person that commissioned me, gave me an option of two. I could either have picked this one or I, you know what, well, I don't even remember the other one because I was just like, yep, I want to do Luxray. <laughs> Surprisingly, no one's ever suggested a Luxray on my Instagram stories. Hey, Sebastian, this is looking great. Thank you. I wanted to make it like epic, you know? Sizor, yeah. Did you say Thizor or Sizor? Unboxing video when they get your stuff. Yeah, Retro doesn't know about that video yet, by the way. Retro doesn't have um, TikTok or Facebook. This is why I didn't do it on Instagram. Sizor, it's not a bad choice. Yeah, so it was either that one or... Um, Sizor would be your pronunciation. Okay. I'm glad that I'm not saying it like weirdly. But yeah, I purposely um purposely put it on Facebook and Instagram so Retro wouldn't see. <laughs> Although there's only like one thing in there that he doesn't know that I put in there. Still's Facebook and TikTok. <laughs> He does know that I filmed it. It's kind of hard to post on Instagram at the moment with the um, with the cats. Time. Ah, oh, it's 6.45 p.m. You want to anger the algorithm, yeah. You can do an unboxing video, I just hate being on camera. You don't have to have your face. Just your hands. Hey, KO3. How are you? I did an unboxing today. Oh yeah, did you? How'd that go? Sounds like Spider-Man. Gonna have to do some wall rearranging. Correct. Show no skin at all. Tongue sounds good. 
getting coffee in me and getting ready to drive like what to work like mad max please be careful You know, since that, like, Game Chops are on, um, Twitter, I was gonna, like, message them and, and send them the cult song and be like, hey, what the fuck? <laughs> also, my stepmom mentioned that I should make stickers with the words great moments are born from great opportunities. Chopsticks unboxing. One of the people we've told off for driving recklessly. <laughs> Yeah, make your choices. Find a good photo of Rody for a portrait to even it out between you and Mitch. You're all good, x -File. I'm still so impressed that Mitch did that. Four cats, only three paintings. What photos do you have of Rudy? So all of that and there's blue. I have to remember blue. <laughs> brag about that drive 70 and a 45 well you're a dickhead then people die because of people like you like every time someone passes me like that i literally like give them bad juju like i'm i just like i say i hope that you crash into a pole so you hurt yourself and no one else on the road It's around longer, so cell phones, but the most are just, you know, cell phone pics. Am I allowed to watch the video? If you don't want me to see it, I don't have to. Um, I can send it to you if you would like, because I know that you don't have TikTok and Facebook. And um, I will send you the one without captions. That is not safe. Chaos. I enjoy your presence here. It'd be ashamed to ban you. But I am not against it. That's still a lot. <laughs> like a school zone is, um, is it 10K or 25K? 20, I think it's 25, 25, yeah. Just like in cars in general, because I wish we could move away from a car-based city design to more people and active transit-friendly environment. That would be actually really nice. My car squeals. School zones are 40 kilometers per hour. They're 25 here. They're different and like it varies state by state, but in South Australia, they're 25. This one is annoying me. Thirty five miles per hour. That's too much. For that smart state, Victoria would throw a fit if there were twenty five here.
<laughs> that looks weird. Why it locks, Ray? Why is your head looking weird? Way more safety conscious. Hey, Pineapple. Look down upon those driving recklessly a lot more. I always have. I've known people who died because of reckless driving. Like, I, I wasn't, like, close to them, but it's still kind of, like... It's one of those things that you get told when you're in school that, you know, when... By that time you are the age of like, you know, 25, you're going to know like a bunch of people who've died. Like they gave you a number and stuff. And you're all kind of thinking, oh yeah, you know, and they're like, yeah, well, you know, a certain percentage of that is going to be um, like car crashes. And you know what? They're right. <laughs> Even more, vo I think I'm more vocal about it. Hey, be vocal, Dobby. I don't care. Fast is reckless, that's true. If you're driving above the speed limit, you're driving recklessly. Uh, P. I. Kyoko Ko. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Galactiverse. On my recess, I have 50, 45 more minutes to go after that, but then I will be here. Ooh, nice. Enjoy recess. Why is it giving me syndrome vibes? You know, like. <laughs> There's literally no excuse that you can give any of us that driving fast above the speed limit that's recommended is safe because it's not. Because like, okay, you might know your surroundings and you might like be confident about your driving ability, but there are other people on the road. And like, they may not be familiar. They may be from out of state. They may be from like, you know, somewhere that is, has different road rules, or they may be learners, or they may be like, you know, you don't know. Like you're the problem with like, you know, people that have anxiety to drive, honestly. That's an Incredibles villain hair. Yeah, that's what I that's what I said. Guess what? Ooh, what? There's a posted limit for a reason. Yeah, follow it. I never understood people that were like that hated um when the cops were like posted to um, you know, get people at certain stops. Like, uh, well, if you didn't speed, then you wouldn't be worried about him. Respect other drivers. Mm -hmm. Hey, thanks, Mitch. Oh, X file. Damn, I thought that would have been Mitch. I thought we would have gotten a ban. <laughs> yeah, we don't like that kind of negativity here. I'm pretty sure that was the person that said that they were banned in other chats. How's the mobile? That's okay. What are you doing? I thought you were at the computer. Promo for first promo set of watercolors. It's a half pan with professional colors. Oh my gosh, yay! Which brand? Oh my gosh. I would love to get myself um, some Holbian, Holbian. I want to get myself some of those, but in gouache. I want to try gouache again. I really want to try and like it this time. Antagonistic, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if they come back in talking about that stuff again, they're getting banned. Oh, 
I wait around for a sound for a bit. Hey, hydrate everybody. Usually the other way, yeah. Mm -hmm. Really bothers me. Damn dogs almost got run over every day because of reckless driving. Yeah. Um, I am definitely not an advocate of speeding in any way, shape or form. Art Aqua. Ooh, and you're back with a snack, Scarlet. What snack did you get? We don't tolerate reckless drivers, exactly. Definitely one of those people who I would like see on the road and be like, I hope that you die. And I know that that's like really dark and really horrible thing to think, but like, well, no, not die. I think it would be like better if they crash their car to the point that their car was totaled like into a pole like something that's not going to hurt other people right into a pole and so like they get paralyzed and can never drive again but have to pay off the insurance of crashing their car that would be great i have finish class next Ooh, enjoy finish other to completely disregard the entirety of the feedback you're getting and continue on without apology exactly they don't have signs up everywhere in our little community to try to get people to slow down. I swear I make them drive faster though. Yeah, because people like breaking rules. And like being dickheads, apparently. Like, read the room. What brand of car does an egg drive a Yolks wagon? That was really bad. It's always the innocent people who suffer from their actions. Always. Exactly. That's why I always kind of wish that something happens to them first without injuring anybody else. And I know that may sound like quite evil of me, but I don't care if it saves another life. Okay, Harry Potter. Play stupid games, win stupid prizes. All right, this question is for Grav. Please let them answer first. If they get it incorrect, then it's open to the rest of chat. Um, who disarms Albus Dumbledore, becoming the master of the Elder Wand? Already someone's hit it. People are stupid. That is correct. Well done. Who's there? Daisy. Daisy who? Daisy me rolling. They hate him. Trolling me, trying to catch me riding dirt. I wanted to say white and nerdy then. One Masters was such a shoehorned in bit of world building. Oh my god. 
of my eye, I'm dying. Never heard the original Weird Out, Weird Out for the win. Okay, I'm glad I'm not the only one <laughs> who likes that version better. I was talking to my brothers about the fact that Mitch had like a bowling ball. He had his like own, he has his own bowling ball, right? And so like personalized and stuff. And they sent that gif, the gif of white and nerdy. They said they, something about, um, it's not they see me bowling, it's, um, I can't remember the line that they talk about bowling. She started yelling, oh no. So Australian. So bad here, you wouldn't believe. Not just cars either. People speeding with dirt bites, quads, and everything. Really? I know that America's really bad. Like, I remember, um, like, being shocked about the fact that literally everybody speeds. I mean, here, I'll get, like, you know, one or two people on the drive from my place to my mom's place that will overtake me because they're speeding and being an idiot. But, like, everyone there does it. And it's really strange. I can understand why people are scared of driving. <laughs> Depends on where in America you're at. Yeah, this is Minnesota. Ungravy. Hey, welcome back. Yeah, within five kilometers. Yeah, mm -hmm. Minnesota's fun. <laughs> Little village would be nice and quiet. 98% of people are idiots. What you having for dinner, mom? Most of just highways, regular surface streets are reasonably consistent speed limit drivers. That said, Queensland police reckon people at least I reckon at least one quarter of the drivers at any point in time here are on meth. Oh my god. Fix this for you. Scared of traffic where I live. They don't really push the street laws and my sister-in-law was walking on one of those crossings um, for people to cross the street. Almost get run over because people just don't stop. It's ridiculous. I live in a forest away from humanity with internet, of course. That would be great. I'd love that. An island in Scotland for sale we can all move to. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> all of us. Can, oh my god. I need to get some tea. Um, so there's one thing I kind of want to do. And that is... Like, I don't really know how to draw lightning. But I kind of want to do some, some like lightning effect. Something like that. See if this works. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Hi, Ellie. Scotland, yes, please. Yeah, mum wants the Scottish guys. Can't have my castle if I don't have one. Let's go right account. I could live in a forest with any with many animals, but with internet. Dual plus one. Alright, I am going to go grab some tea, so I'll let you guys play words on stream. Hopefully, um any dickheads don't come back. And if they do, feel free to ban them. Um make sure that you go stretch, get your own beverage, um, get a snack if you need to, but until I'm back. Enjoy words.
How are you all going over here? It's so very cold in here. One more word, guys. You got this. E is incorrect. Oh no, don't worry. I'm I'm stupid. <laughs> hey turn job. Oh wait, yeah, no, E. E is incorrect. And only five letter words. So E is incorrect, five letter words, and Another A. Another A is the hidden letter.
Oops, E. <laughs> Ah, so close, so close. Good job, guys. 18 is still pretty good. That's so hard, yeah. Once it gets to those levels, it's really difficult. It's me. I'm bat. Surprise. Nyad is such a word. Yeah, same crazy. <gasps> Surprise! Thanks, X File. Oh my gosh, 21 months. Welcome back. Surprise. <laughs> Here comes a sub. Do -do -do -do. Thank you. A little pop up sitting there. Yeah, that happened. Okay, I don't want brown. I want black for this Luxray. Okay, this is my black one, I think. Oh my God, my eye is bothering me so damn much. Like you have no idea. No idea. Did I miss a dickhead before when I was making gravy? Yes. Yes, you did. Warm cloth, yeah, that's what I've been doing. But like, I, I'm i streaming, so I can't really do that at the moment. It's like, uh, now that I'm like moving around a lot and using my eye, it's hurting more because I can't just rest it. <laughs> Don't know what you eat for breakfast. Ooh, what are the options? One day my resubs will be on a day where you, uh, both you and Mitch stream and I'll put a joke in his and the punchline in yours. Wow. Cereal. Wow. An iPad so you don't use it. I know, it's so painful. Are you cereal? Why did I think of that too? Whoa, what was that? Oh, scrambled eggs. Sandwiches, go past. What happened to your eye? It just hurt. Wasn't it a weird, weird letter? Yeah, the L. We're 90s kids. <laughs> the L. It got a slashy. Hope it feels better. Thanks. Hey, ASMR. How are you? Eye patches when you were a kid? Oh, really? So this is a commission from my Kofi. So if you wanted your own custom Pokemon painting, then Kofi is the place to get it. Hey, thanks. How is stream? Stream is doing well, thank you. How are you? Wait, did I ask that? You're doing all right, you did, okay. So okay, it's okay if you can't afford a digital tablet. If you ever need help financially, let me know. Well, look, I'm not against you um like buying me things or donating money. I do have a digital tablet, but I mean, if you're offering, You want to donate? That'd be great. Not all artists want to be digital, you know. It's definitely a thing on Twitch where like a lot of artists here are digital. Why does that look like a Pokemon? Um, because it is. I do Pokemon here every Monday and have been doing for two and a half years. 
you can have a look on my Instagram. But recently I did a Lapras. This was last week's one. Digital is the future. That's what they told me when I was at school. And so I decided to become a traditional artist and here I am. <laughs> Pokemon day. Ooh, pretty. Thank you. Hey, thanks, Mitch. There's my Kofi where you can donate or buy your own. I like that. Thank you. If you go to the commissions tab, um, there is Pokemon commissions available as well as my pet portrait commissions. AI is going to kill digital. Traditional is the real future. It's interesting how that turns around, isn't it? I feel really sorry for my digital art friends, though. AI isn't art at all. AI-generated images are not art. We have lots of traditional artists here. Yes, we do. We also have a lot of uh, digital artists here. New at digital, but it's like starting from the beginning. Digital is so hard. Like, I felt overwhelmed by digital because, like, there's so many things that you can do with it. So when you have... Um, you know, when you've got like watercolors in front of you, pencils in front of you, like you have your su supplies that you have to use in that piece and you have to use them. Like you have to figure out how that supply works. You have to use the brushes that you have. You have to use the paints that you have. Like you can't just go online and download a new one, which is what you can do with digital. Like you can just download something. Oh, I just drew on my little sloth. Aliens. I got one solved for how long it takes an art stream to talk about how they generated images. Mm -hmm. Spilling salt on the counter is more than anything a computer could generate. Create them from scratch. Well, that too. And that's so overwhelming as well because it's like, well, how, how do I, <clears throat> how do I know? It's got stuck in my throat there, but like, how do I know how to do that? And, you know, you can be inspired by a lot of other people artists and stuff and you're just like but how and even like have the same brushes that they use but it looks nothing like it and you're just like how are they getting that effect off to the kitchen to clean up mess a salt mess mitch what are you doing Picasso. Hey, you want to like um, make history? If you bought like a traditional piece of mine for more than that, like 351 billion, um, we could make history. Do you want to like, do you want to do it? Do you want to buy one of my art pieces? More fun than digital, in my opinion, feels more accomplishing to finish. Not saying people who actually draw digital and draw it all from scratch and render because that's cool. But AI is not art. No, it's not. I get the feeling he's trolling a bit. That's why I'm waiting for like actual hard evidence of this. Picasso was a time traveler. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And the pyramids were built by aliens. Didn't Picasso die in the 70s? Yeah, mm -hmm. so many. I can feel it. Actually, I think maybe two because the other one's getting a snack. And AI is art. Gotta go, you should get some sleep. Hope your eye feels better and that you have a great rest of your stream. Thank you so much, Retro. I look forward to showing you when it's finished. And thank you so much for your support again. You are absolutely incredible. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't be able to do this without you. Came back without snack to do just do just that. Rub out any mistakes completely with no trace of the errors that you made. That is definitely like um, a a huge selling point for digital art. But with traditional art, we don't make mistakes. We just have happy accidents. Hey, King GB, how are you? Let Exile have it. <laughs> I 
love my layers. I recently hit a new record for layer count. 258 layers for one picture. Oh my god, my program can't even hold 128 layers. 258. Why did it say 128? This is... Okay, this is where my number, like, dyslexia or something comes in because... Why did I think it was 128 when I literally just read 258? They just, like, they literally mix up inside my head. Read too fast for me to keep up. Oh, what a pity. Shall I say it slower for you so 